A couple of days ago, I 3D printed a giant nut and bolt, and I wanted to find a way that I'd be able to put it to the test. And I thought that the best way to do that would be to order a crane scale from online and see exactly how much weight the bolt can take. That was like a Migos. Obviously, this isn't going to be the most comprehensive or thorough test, but using what's available at the shop, we're at least going to be able to put on a cool demonstration of what this material can actually handle. Using these chains, that lift, that scale, and my car, we're going to get to the bottom of it and figure out exactly how strong the 3D printed nut and bolt really is. So as you can see on the scale, 660 pounds or 300 kilograms, and there's no way that a 3D printed bolt holds 660 pounds. I guess I'll pull my car up, get the lift set up, and we'll get this going. I think, I think this'll be good. This is good. It's not perfect. It's hooked up directly to the frame, not touching anything else. The lift is in a good spot. The only part that I don't really like is this. Bolt's ready to go. Same one that was in the last video. And the chain isn't touching anything. It's not touching the engine, not touching any coolant hoses or lines. So it's going to be able to get nice and tight and it's not going to damage anything. 200, 250 pounds. I think I'll be pretty happy with that. But anything higher than that, and I'll be pretty surprised. So I'm going to go over here, and I'm just going to slowly start jacking it up, and I'm going to keep my eye on the scale, and we'll see what happens. First one. Fifty-five pounds. So 110 pounds, and so far everything is still looking good. Let's keep moving. Two seventy. So we're fifty pounds past where I thought it was going to break, so I'm happy. Four fifty. Five hundred. This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. 660 pound limit, overload, 3D printed bolt. Damn it. What do I do now? So do I lower it, get rid of the scale? try and lift my car up with it. I'm not thrilled about the idea, to be honest with you. Seems like that's really my only option. We're not gonna be able to know how much it holds. I'm nervous enough as it is, I'm just waiting for this thing to explode. I'm jacking up the lift like this, I'm trying to like reach away. Goodness. All right, I found a face shield, so at least I got something. That's crazy. Here's a piece. Oh, found it. Could have gone worse. It could have gone worse. 
I said in the beginning of the video that I would be happy if it held, what, 250 pounds, 230 pounds? And this was almost off the ground, so I, th I think things went pretty well. I'm happy.